Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I recently got contacted by a really nice lady called Daisy and she is the owner of Banish which is a skincare company. They contacted me seeing if I wanted to try out any of their products and had a little look, told them which products I was interested in. So I only asked for one product but she kindly sent me three extra products and a bag to have them in. I obviously I have makeup on but I don't have acne and I never have had acne but I do get spots so this review isn't from someone who has acne it's from someone who gets the occasional spot so I've been trying this product out for about two weeks or just about two weeks the vitamin C cream which looks like this and I so far think it's really good actually last week formed a very disgusting spot on my chin and I just I did not want it to form like it was coming up it was one of those really big ones ones that you know if it goes any further it is going to hurt <laughs> I was using this during the day and I found that it was a bit too tacky feeling on my skin and I didn't like that during the day so I changed from using it in the day to using it at night time and I found that for me personally it worked better you really don't need a lot of product on your face at all because it does go a long way like it's not really thick and you don't have to apply it thick in like a thick layer but it does spread around your skin so you don't really need a lot at all with vitamin C it does help to boost the collagen so um, it reduces scars it reduces dark spots it firms up the skin as well if you do have acne then you may find that it helps to lighten the scars i will leave all the products that i'm going to mention in the description box below so you can go and read up about it and um, read it in more detail so when i was using this obviously i mentioned that i was having a disgusting spot on my face i thought i'm definitely going to keep using it because i saw it forming and I didn't want to stop using this because every now and then I kind of stop using a product. Um, I'm not really a person that uses a product every single day. I started using this again and literally the next day the spot vanished. I don't know if it was this product, like just this product only because I did use my Savlon antiseptic cream on the spot as well as this. So I don't know if it was a combination of the two or if it was just this one, or maybe it was just that one. I have used the Savlon uh, antiseptic cream before on my spots, and it does work, but it never normally works that quick. Like, it normally works, like it stops the spot from forming if you get it, like, before it's formed. I normally have to do that for about two to three days, and the spot does go down gradually, but this was overnight, and I was like, wow, that was amazing because this was one of those ones that would just be like a big boil on your face. The other vitamin C product they gave me is this. It's the vitamin C beauty elixir and it's just a spray. So you basically spray it on your face and it says you can spray whenever and wherever. This says that it reduces redness. It helps tighten your pores. It helps to reduce and prevent acne or just any kind of spot in general. I personally found that it was something I liked to use during the night time again. I did find that I had to use it quite sparingly because if I did put too much on it would be just too wet on my face and it would sort of drip down my face. The next product I got given is this. It is the vitamin C E ferulic acid serum. So the ferulic acid actually helps to prevent anything like sun damage when you get um, sunspots or um, hyperpigmentation and things like that. So this is really good for people that do have acne or spots and they tend to turn into like a dark spot on your face. So basically when I do get spots I do get dark pigments on my skin from the spot. It takes a while for it to gradually fade and go away. So this should hopefully stop that and reduce it quicker or just not let it happen at all. So I am excited to use this. The last product I have to talk about is this. It is the pumpkin enzyme mask. I have not used this and I don't think I will use it. It looks like this inside. Yes, it just looks like mashed up pumpkin. I don't... <laughs> I don't really like the smell of it if I'm honest. The reason I haven't used this product is just because I don't have acne and I feel like this is best for someone who has acne and acne only. You are supposed to put it thinly all over your face 
staying away from like the eye and under eye area and obviously the lips as well and you are supposed to wait till it kind of dries and then you'd wash it off during that time it will tingle on your face so you will feel it on your face you will feel it working on your face sometimes people will like to fan their face um, if they feel like it's not a nice feeling for them and it kind of helps to cool it down I feel like for me this isn't really a product that I necessarily need so from what I've used I have really enjoyed this and I would definitely like to say thank you to Banish for sending me these products to try out I do highly recommend them they do ship internationally obviously I'm from the UK they are an American based um, company but they do ship to the UK I will leave the shipping page below so you can go have a look of anywhere you are. I would definitely look at their website and see what would suit you best as well because obviously for me not having acne I would recommend the vitamin C but if you do have acne then I'm sure you would find a lot of products on there that you would really probably enjoy. Thank you for watching this video if you liked it please give it a thumbs up let me know anything in the comment section or on my social media pages which are linked below. So thank you for watching and I will see you in my next video. But today's video is a haul video. I will just get on and start it because I have quite a few things to share with you and I don't want this video to be too long. First thing I want to share with you is actually